supermarket in the middle of quarantine and this video is just to show you guys one what a russian supermarket looked like and two how it is during quarantine which the only difference is it might be a little bit empty like the streets are so empty So in fact, you can pay Ubers in Russia with cash. I know you can do that at home. Um, what is your Hadro Gun Vlihod? Huh? Hadro Gun Vlihod. Tuna? Da. This is like the exit. I don't know why Ubers like leaving y'all. Leaving us. At the, Cause then I'm gonna have to walk all the way up here to get a, um, a shopping cart. Again? Actually, wait, today is Saturday, though. It's my pack today. And this is my got a little bit of store. It's like a, a mini mall. The KFC down there. Yeah, I hate coming to the supermarket on Saturdays, but I forgot today was a Saturday, guys. $10 coins. Samara doesn't like walking to the supermarket, but today we're gonna go to all the aisles. I don't know where she Kid section, baby food. Actually, I'm gonna go look for applesauce. Applesauce, because applesauce is really good for you. We got the plum, apple, peach, and pear. And I like snacking on applesauce, it's a good snack because it has a little bit of calories and it tastes good. I don't be getting the ones that got like broccoli or pumpkin in it or like the cereal because that's really for kids. And I'm not a kid when you walk in. This is like all the stuff that is on sale. We got chocolate, coffee, mushrooms, rice, candy, juice, beer, tea, alcohol. Easter is 19th, so they have like the little what do you call those like Easter celebration stuff? And they make a thing called kippage. I forgot what it is in English. I'ma write it below what it is in English. So like you see all their it's basically like a bread with some frosting. I had it kind of dry, but yeah. So things with the yellow tag like this means there's a discount. That's all I gotta say. Crazy stuff, and we just run through the aisles so y'all can see too. Pants, fox, y'all. Look at this big ass cup. I don't know if that's what it's called, but in Jamaica, that's what we call it. And like, usually only like old people will have it, or they'll just be at your house, just like there. But Russian people love these. Men. everything in Russia comes in bags this is hand soap y'all it's in a bag oh now niggas want to have green Greek yogurt and I want a Greek yogurt it wasn't there oh Russians love cottage cheese guys look at the variety of cottage cheese I like these. It's like cottage cheese with like fruit and like it. It's like jam. So that's jelly, and you just like mix it in and take like it is really good. And it's a really healthy snack. <coughs> High protein, low calories, yo. Yeah. All that is kind of cheese. Awesome. And they also love sour. Oh, there's somebody inside, yo. That's like the big fridge. I ain't know that to try this if you ever come to Russia. It's called Chudo. It's like a vanilla, what's gonna call it? Milkshake. It's so good. Before anybody starts to drag me for drinking the milk in the supermarket, one, I'm gonna just cash. I'm gonna just pay for the, the empty box and have to throw it away. Two, I did sanitize it before the box or whatever. And obviously, the straw comes in the thing. So. And Russian people love, oh my god, what's that? Caviar.
Like basically social distancing because when you're ordering the seafood from there, one of the employees has to like call her to like, cut it or like just pick it up and like, put it in a bag and price it. I don't know what all these are called, and I don't feel like you're in there, but some type of fish, dry fish, and I actually don't even look good y'all. I think one of them is probably like red herring or something like scrap. But some people love this, I tell you. Well, anybody who's been to Europe know that Europeans love, um, what you call it, like sparkling water, mineral water, water with gas, whatever you call it. I became water with gas because it's easy for Russians to understand. I don't know how y'all drink that stuff because that stuff tastes nasty. Are we outside, y'all? If you ever see this beer, try it. It's really good. The cranberry, the lingonberry one is good too. Honestly, I want some Corona. We didn't have Corona in the supermarket. This ass. Can. They always put the snacks next to the beer. And here we go with wine, y'all. Now we ain't talking about language. It's separated by country, so France, Italy, Spain, different wines from different countries in Europe, Russia, and yeah, that's vodka, vodka again, because it's Russia, people love vodka, yo. champagne, wine in a box, Liquor martini type gin tequila patrol me by Jamaican at heart with the big butt up to you know that whiskey on vodka again. And these are the cognacs. You got them big ass ones. Honestly, I wouldn't try one of them. I'm gonna get my friends to try it with me one day because they're about to be dead drunk from all that. Russians are basically ahead of time with this mask, whole mask thing, which is why you see a lot of them do have masks. Because they always wear masks. Like if one of them like even had a little bit of cough, they would always wear a mask just because they wouldn't want to get everybody else sick. Which is pretty thoughtful. And them just just hold that everywhere like a month ago, I tried to get it. So that like, everywhere. So I'd be walking around like. Europeans are raw tea, y'all. And now we in the little candy kind of out. That basically like jelly. Um, I forgot what this one. Popcorn, y'all. I love popcorn. Popcorn is a very healthy snack, y'all. And y'all, please love dry bread. Look at this. You could bust somebody here with all these birds, with some of these birds. And this is why he comes to the market on Saturday. Mad pat, mad people, yo. But yeah, yo, look at these bread. This is tough. Do you see this? Like, it makes a sound, yo. Told you. Snacks. Ooh, Cheetos. I love me some Cheetos. And honestly, before all this coronavirus, I never used to snack, snack as much. Now that I'm home 24-7. Well, I used to always be home 24-7, but bored 24-7. I'll be snacking all day. These cookies? Fire, yo. Oh my gosh. Where's the other one? That's better. I don't see that. Maybe I have some good ass candy bar. Chocolate. And every supermarket here got their own brand. This 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 brand is only found in this supermarket and I gotta find this brand. This name is supermarket, okay? Yo y'all. This chocolate? Fire. 
It's finished. Fire. I see, I'm just about to go to the... And they love these little mini croissants with a filling inside. They... Oh, we just came. They gave us that OD and I used to eat it, but now I never mind that shit. They're very free. Um, what, what taste good? Let me tell y'all. That I've had. These, the garlic breads, fire. Matter of fact, I'm gonna just get some and make some pasta. That's gonna be some candy. I don't need four. I really just need two. Please don't have nine. Please only have mad amount. This bread is mad good too. What? Fire. And uh well, let me see this shit is, this shit is hot. It gotta be fresh. Today's the 18th year. Yeah. And you know moving to Russia I became a big tea lover. Sugar. It's the healthy stuff, like gluten free type stuff. Bars, veggie chunks down there. Everything's gluten free. And then we just got flour, baking stuff. It's kind of contrast, right? All the seasonings. And baking stuff. All the stuff for that, like the decorating eggs for their, their Easter. Matter of fact, what did I want? Y'all, I'm gonna instant food, y'all. Mad ramen, mashed potatoes type, granola, cereal. Let me see, this is very good, which a lot of people outside are. It's like, I, I'm assuming it's European, but muesli in Russia also means cereal. It's very good food. Cornmeal, all them grains type, buckwheat and stuff. Bulga quinoa, couscous, my own meal. I've been on my own for home. But here, rice. Rice fruit section, y'all. And healthy stuff again. Protein and shit. Yeah, dry fruits over there. Macaroni, you get nuts. Wife it up, but you know. <laughs> Well, let me get some penne. I'm about to make some rasta pasta in video and show y'all. And honey. Fun fact, the Russians eat honey by the spoonful. It's like, it's supposed to be very good for you with honey yet. Penne. about the drug. And all things in a um, can. Tuna. This tuna be fire. I never had a Mexican one before, so this tuna would be fire. <laughs> the salmon. Beans, greens. People don't know how to move in Russia. Niggas do not say excuse me. I'm not trying to touch nobody. Olives. Beans, greens. Pickles, ew. Mushrooms again. Got a little fridge, y'all. Condensed milk, like I said, everything being a bag, y'all thought I was playing. Cakes, them cakes just do not taste good. Dough. Damn, what kind of dough is this? Oh, you can make your own the um coupage, the um what's it called? What's the color name? Thing that you for Easter? Oh, you can get this one. Also, mad tiny. Like these. But yo, they be mad smart because the back ones be mad gross. Trying to outsmart me. Can't see shit behind them. Oh, I forgot any peppers. I hold up here. I don't know. Veggies and stuff. Cheese. They go to the really show you all that in a second but here's the most interesting aisle of them all all this aisle is sausage y'all fresh love me bacon sausage ham sausage 
sausage. Sausage. Crazy, right? Varenki, aka dumplings, Russian. Love them. They be having potatoes in the middle, butter, like beef, cabbage. They got chicken sausages, frozen chicken. These just look mad old compared to the fact that these are kind of fresh. Cutlets. Why did I say cutlets? Patties, like beef patties, turkey patties, more meat. Sometimes Matt oil again, coconut oil, just ketchup and stuff. Here. Just keep all those olives because you don't need nothing in them. The I don't like the dog food, the cat food section. Electronics. <laughs> Me and Samar are trying to find yoga mats, y'all, so we could work out. I don't know how that's gonna go. I don't even know where to find yoga mats. Just clothes. Matches. Oh, did y'all see me? I don't know. Found them! Is this a yoga mat? Oh, that was not a yoga mat. It's a monster. That's not a yoga mat. I think it's made for outside or something. You can. This shit is mad. Not working with me at all. That nigga buy mad meat. See, when it's we're done. All the stuff. And I was out. Trip to the Russian supermarket. I hope you guys enjoy it. 
don't forget to like subscribe to my channel K click the little bell so you can get a notification or just my other glove i just took it off my hand so i won't touch my phone with the same hand i was using all the stuff but yeah thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe